what is going on guys welcome to 22nd ruby tutorial in this tutorial i am going to show you the break statement now here you can see within this comment box i have written few pattern this pattern one is having five rows and five columns like this the pattern is one two three four five repeated five times now we will first print this pattern using for loop and after that we will modify the codes of pattern 1 and turn it into this pattern 2 using the break statement this will clear our concepts of break statement now let's start our coding first let's write r which implies rows in 1 dot dot 5 right now why i have taken this 1 dot dot 5 because there are 5 rows 1 2 3 4 5 so uh, value of r varies from 1 to 5 now let us write another for loop for c in 1 dot dot 5 again let's call it down yeah now again i have taken c for column which whose value varies from 1 2 3 4 5 here again we are having 5 columns so that is why i have taken the value of c ranging from 1 to 5 now let's write a statement to print the values print interpolation here our variable is c we have to print c then give a space so that it will look neat now save it and execute it here we go here we are getting the output like this but this is not our required pattern to get our actual output we need to add a another statement here like print and an escape character backslash n this is a new line character as i discussed it with you earlier now let's save it and execute it yeah here we go now let's see what's going on here when row is one then for row equal to one this loop is executed five times so we are getting the value of c as one two three four five then after that a new line character which breaks the statement and comes here now when row becomes two then again this loop is executed for five times so the cycle goes on like one two three four five 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 then till the r is five now this was not our objective guys our objective was to learn the break statement now let us print this pattern by modifying this these codes of pattern one and by adding the break statement here now what we require actually we just want to remove three four five in each rows so we just need to add a simple statement here break if c equal to equal to two now let's save it and execute it bingo here we go we are getting the desired output now how we are getting it whenever the value of c becomes 2 it breaks out of this loop and print this statement which is backslash n then again it comes to this statement for r equal to 2 for this r equal to 2 again we are getting c value as 1 and 2 we are printing 1 and 2 then again if when c becomes 2 it breaks out of this loop and comes to this statement now for r equal to 3 r equal to 4 r equal to 5 we are getting these row values 1 2 1 2 1 2 like this so hope you guys understood the concept of break statement where you use it we actually use it to break break out of the loop now that is all for this tutorial guys catch you guys in the next tutorial stay tuned thank you and don't forget to subscribe